those of us in the astrology community talk a lot about the difficulties involved with being a Capricorn or an Aquarius sun, but we hardly ever talk about the spiritual protection that comes with being ruled by Saturn. In case you are wondering, yes, I do offer private astrology readings, link in bio to schedule your appointment. And if you would like to participate in our weekly astrology Q&A sessions, I host one every Tuesdays and Wednesdays at 7.30 p.m. Central Time. Come join us. It's a lot of fun. Now back to Capricorn. Those of you who've been following this channel for a while or this account for a while know that I am a Capricorn stellium. And anybody who is Capricorn sun or who has a lot of Capricorn in their chart or who's a Capricorn stellium like myself, I should say, knows that it's a double-edged sword. So on one hand, life is very hard on you and you have to walk a tight path. But on the other hand, when people mess with you, things go really, really bad for them really fast. So naturally, that gives Capricorn a lot of power. So the power that Capricorn carries isn't just in their physical strength, it's also spiritual because Capricorn is an old soul and Saturn carries a lot of karma. Many of you in the environmental community already know that Greta Thunberg um, sent a tweet, <laughs> one of the most important tweets in our history, and shut the year down with that tweet uh, to Andrew Tate in response to him harassing her online because, I don't know, maybe he was bored? Andrew Tate is a Sagittarius sun, and Greta is a Capricorn stellium. She has Capricorn as her sun sign, her moon sign, as well as her Mercury. All she did in response to his hostile tweet to her was tweet one tweet. And that one tweet in response to him currently has him with the authorities in prison looking at some serious charges related to human trafficking and inappropriate behaviors with minors. Now that is the power of Capricorn. That is the power of Capricorn stellium, where you don't even have to lift a finger to defend yourself when people are talking badly about you, when people are betraying you, when people are backstabbing you, when people are stealing from you, when people are trying to ruin your reputation, when people are trying to ruin, ruin your finances, when people are trying to ruin your relationships. You don't have to do anything. The universe will do it all for you. You don't even have to lift a finger. This is why I encourage both Aquariuses and Capricorns to not take revenge because the universe has your back. Greta didn't even have to lift a finger. And this guy is looking at prison probably for the rest of his life. We currently have Sun, Mercury, and Pluto in Capricorn, so I would tread lightly.